Now, let's talk about the voice to text feature on the iPhone. In this tutorial, I'll show you how you can turn it off and more generally how it works and what are some good things to know about it. So let's begin right now. First of all, the voice to text is a feature that will rewrite whatever you say to the iPhone. It turns it into a text, so it's not a voice message. And the other side, the person who you are texting has no idea that you used your voice to type the message. So here in the messages, you can see two microphones. One is here next to the to text field, right next to my type text. The other one is at the bottom under my keyboard. It's funny because they both do the very same thing. And yeah, one of the buttons is redundant. But if you want to disable it, like to turn it off, remove the microphone from there, you can do so easily. You'll just navigate to the settings app on your iPhone. And once you're inside there, you then need to go to the general section. Then scroll down a bit more towards the bottom and keyboard section should be visible to you. So naturally open it up. Now there is an entire section called dictation. And there you can manage the languages used for dictation and like disable or enable different ones. But to turn this feature off completely, just turn off the enable dictation toggle right there. You might be required to confirm it one more time. So click that and you're pretty much done with it. Coming back to the messages or wherever else you use your keyboard, you can see that the microphone icon is no longer there. Both of the microphones, in fact, have disappeared. So there's no longer the possibility to use voice to type in text. There is, however, still the option to send voice messages. You can still record yourself speaking and send the voice memo. You can get there by clicking on the A icon. The one looking similar to App Store icon and the voice memo voice message button will show up right there. So that's pretty useful, and this feature isn't going anywhere. So that's how you can use it. That's how you can turn it off. For more videos like this one, make sure you are subscribed to this channel. Make sure you're part of the Fox Tech community. You can also check out this video you can see right here on the screen because I think you'll find it just as useful. Thanks a lot for watching till the end, and I'll catch you guys in the future. Peace.